Oh yes, uh, especially with that booming three. So sa first co-op, sir natin, ganda na labanan dito eh. Pero Rainer's line kasi really set the tone. Um, Reggie Johnson hit two three-pointers. Chris Chu did uh, hit his own two as well uh, early on. And kaya naman, they took control. No? Down 2-0, biglang nag-run sila. Went up by double digits doon pala sa first quarter. And uh, ito nga, ganda ng laro nito uh, nung maaga pa. Kasi fresh to fresh pa siya nung panahon. Oh, yes. And uh, a lot of repertoire. He showed it early in the first quarter with the shots from the outside. Back to the basket place, finishing off with his left hand. It had a total of 15 points in the first quarter alone. In the second quarter, Campbell showed some flashes. Problema, he committed his third personal. So, you know, si Campbell. And Rainer Shine took full advantage of that. Oh, yes, especially itong kanilang uh, player na si Chris Chu. He was able to nail shots from the outside. And good thing for Alaska. Meron silang Calvin Agueva who uh, lifted their spirits up. A lot of energy plays for them. So after being down by as big as 13 points in the second quarter, they were able to trim it down to just six at the end of two. That's right. Pero nung sa third quarter naman, eh, Alaska yeah, did cut it down immediately to four. The problem is, nag-run na naman itong uh, Rain or Shine. Binalik sa 13 puntos na naman yung kanilang kalamangan. Reggie Johnson made his present felt inside, but it was more exactly what Chris Chu said dun sa kanyang interview na Reggie Johnson is not all the points. It's a lot of stuff you presses niya alone. Changed everything. Campbell came back in after shooting out and started hitting threes. We didn't know he was gonna leave so much more para sa fourth quarter. Oh further. yes, they were still up. Itong Rainer Shine by eight points. Increased it to 13 early in the fourth quarter. But the booming threes by Tony Campbell who was still not nursing yung kanyang uh, cramping right leg he was able to score a lot of baskets they were still up by uh, one point and take a look at this offensive rebound by reggie johnson he was able to tip that ball in they were up by uh, one point look at its turnover they could have just uh, held, on, held on to that uh, ball and Missy with two seconds left. Akala ni Kaloy, tapos na. And then, Banchero shot happened to force the game to overtime. <laughs> it was an amazing shot mula kay Chris Banchero. Ang problema, it went all for naught. Sabagat sa overtime, first two minutes, nahirapan ng Alaska maka-score. Sunod-sunod na ang basket ng Rainer Shand. And Alaska couldn't get anything going. And that early lead of Rainer Shand, that carry na yun. Carry on na well, nagkaroon ng uh, advantage itong Rain or Shine because for much of that overtime period, wala yung kanilang import na si Tony Campbell. So Rain or Shine really was able to score important baskets. And that was, I thought, a dagger. Oh. That big shot by uh, Bo Belga. Big shot by the big Bo. At ito pa, you play the Iron Lizzie. And this time, he made sure na tama yung decision niya. Ipasok ang tira. Just spread it and made it a two-possession game. And doon na nga nagtapos ang ating laro. 109-103, outscoring Alaska. Was Rainer Shine 15-9 in the overtime period.